Welcome to World War II Online Tutorials, How to Operate Trucks. It's best for the first time to practice offline, but you can go in-game or offline. Go to Vehicles, pull up a truck hauler, and then pick a vehicle such as this Bedford. Now you can see here, the left and right, you have your A and D. And then you have your braking and accelerating. Acceleration with W and S for braking. To start your engine, press E and you have a status indicator on the top left to show your engine status and what gear you're in. You'll start the engine in neutral, shift into first gear by hitting your right bracket key, and as you accelerate, you'll hit the right bracket key again to shift into second gear. Note, it will indicate the gear. Then as you continue to accelerate, you'll shift into third gear. And when you need to brake, as you come to this corner, you'll hit S to slow down. These keys are full on and full off. When I hit the brake, it slowed down all the way to almost a stop. To accelerate again, I had to downshift using the left bracket in order to get into a lower gear to accelerate again. You have to be aware of the terrain as you're driving. Since some of the terrain, if it's too steep and you turn too sharp, you can roll your vehicle over which can damage or kill any units that you are towing or hauling. To reverse, downshift into neutral and press R. Upshift into first gear and press W to accelerate. To get out of reverse, press R again and then drive as usual. You can carry infantry. They simply run up to your truck and press the letter F to join your vehicle. You can tow smaller units by then pushing up to the back of your vehicle, pressing T to connect and disconnect. To build a fortified mobile spawn, you press Z to deploy. If you're too close to an object or if you're on uneven terrain, it'll show up as red. If it is terrain that you can deploy it on, then it'll be green. If you are too far or too close to your objective target, then it will be red. You have a certain zone that it will be okay to deploy in. Once you are ready to deploy, you merely hit Z again and it will then rebuild. To see where you're going while you're driving, you can use your number pad on the keyboard to look around. You have the 9, 6, and 3 positions to look forward, right, and to the rear. And then you have 7, 4, and 1 to look left forward, left, and left rear. You also have down, which is 2, and 8 to look up. And then you have the delete key or period to look back, and 0 to look at your instruments. Let's see what it looks like under actual driving conditions. Now I've sped up the video here just a little bit. As I come to the corner, I can look forward left using the 7 key, and again forward left to anticipate the corner. Hands off to look forward, 4 and 1 to look left into the rear, 6 and 3 to look right in the rear, delete key to look straight behind, and note that the US and British Bedford, the French Lafley, and the German Opel all operate in the same way. Thank you for watching World War II Online Tutorials on how to drive a truck.